Hi, and today I'm going to be covering how to hook up a Virgin Media TiVo box. In this particular case it's with a TXNR609 and let's get on with hooking it up. The TiVo box is only going to actually need three physical connections. The first one is going to be the HDMI from the TiVo box into the 609 to carry the picture and the sound. Then the actual cable signal and lastly the power socket. So the first thing we need to do hook up the HDMI from the TiVo box making sure it's firmly seated into the back of the unit then plug the other end into the AV receiver we're actually connecting into the VCR DVR here but it doesn't really matter which connection you use because we can actually assign that inside the 609 we then need to connect to the HDMI from the output of the 609 off to your display and that is essentially all the connections you need between the TiVo box and the 609. Now we need to make some adjustments in the settings of the actual TiVo box. So go to settings and hit enter. We then go into the audio section of the setup and press enter. Move down to Dolby Digital, press enter. And make sure Dolby Digital is actually ticked. Once you've done this you've now actually set up the Dolby Digital 5.1 output through the HDMI and that's all done and ready. The next thing we need to do is to make sure the video is set correctly. So we move down to the video output settings pressing enter and we just need to make sure that we're in the correct TV aspect ratio and the correct video format which is 1080i. You can actually leave the 609 to upscale that to 1080p with no problem at all. And that's it, it's all done. The TiVo box is now ready to output 5.1 an HD picture. Now we turn our attention to the setup of the 609 or whichever particular AV amp you're actually using. So we go to the input output assign down to number 2 HDMI in and we need to make sure that the input that we're using has the correct HDMI associated with it. And you use the left and right arrow key to cycle through. We are physically plugged into HDMI 2 so that's the one we need to select. A good rule of thumb is any of the HDMI's you're not actually using I would turn off. And you know they're turned off by having the dashes showing on the input. Now the HDMI has been set we can turn our attention to the other settings. We we'll pop down to component video input just to make sure that there's no component in selected on the input that we're using and as you can see there isn't any because we've got the dashes which denotes no input selected so that's nice and convenient and all done. We can now come out of this and go down to digital input. Now we don't want any external digital inputs on this particular input, whether it be coaxial or optical, so we just make sure that there's nothing selected. Now we've made sure that that particular input that we're using has got the correct audio and video settings, we can turn our attention to some other features that the 609 has. Now I've actually gone into the source setup because I want to rename this particular input to show it's a TiVo rather than just VCR DVR. And it's quite simple to do this. Just go into source setup, down to number four, name edit, and then you're into the on-screen keypad. Then you're now in the position to rename that particular input to whatever you want. In this particular case, it's actually going to say TiVo. And once we've done all that, it's now done and ready to use. So I hope you've enjoyed actually watching this video on hooking up and setting up the TiVo box to an Onkyo AV receiver 
whether it's a 609, 809 or even higher. Take care and I hope you've enjoyed this. Bye bye.